dollars. Five dollars. Ah, and five dollars? Are you kidding me? Shoot. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Ashley and today I'm gonna take you along with me as I show you the wonderful decor pieces that I got from Target Dollar Spot, Hobby Lobby, and Dollar Tree for the spring and Easter season. Plus, I picked up a couple of 66% off Valentine's items from Hobby Lobby that I think you're gonna wanna see too. So, if you're excited to see all of that, stay tuned. If you haven't done so already, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on that red button and also clicking on the bell so you're notified about all notifications. Coming up, we're going to be doing a nursery makeover, playroom makeover, a huge house organization series. We're going to be getting the backyard ready for summer and so much more. So definitely subscribe so you're notified. So first, we're going to start with my 66% off Hobby Lobby haul, and this was Valentine's Day stuff. Now, I do want to address, I am still a little under the weather with a cold, so if I sound kind of nasally and stuff, that's what it is, but I really wanted to get this video out there to you guys so you can go check your stores and go shopping because I'm telling you, they are killing it this year with beautiful spring decor and Easter decor. Make a list, head to your stores, go out because you know how it is. If you see it, you don't get it, you're gonna go back and it's gonna be gone. I have not honestly seen my spring or Easter decorations since 2019. That was the last time I've decorated a house for Easter and spring. So I was so excited to jump right into the season. So let's start with Hobby Lobby. All right, so first I got treat bags. These were originally $4.99, and I thought that these were perfect. You can always use treat bags for things, especially if you have little kids. You can use them next year uh, for their Valentine parties and things like that, so definitely a good uh, thing to have. They were $4.99 and then was 66% off. I also got this really cute wooden spoon. It has the heart on it, which I absolutely love. It was originally $5.49 but I got 66% off. <laughs> then I got this. I thought this was funny because I actually say this to my husband, I'm yours, no refunds, or I always say, well, you married it. <laughs> so uh, this was $3.99, but I thought that this was just so cute. Next, I got these picks right here. I was thinking for my tree next year, I can cut these off and just use them as uh, picks and stick them in my tree. These were $3.99 each, but I thought that these were so pretty. So definitely gonna be using those. I also picked up these little rolling pins. I thought that these were adorable. There's an XOXO and then just one with hearts. These each were $4.49, but I thought that these would be perfect for tiered trays. And then I picked up this little house. It does light up, but it does have the little heart. I just thought it was so dainty and cute. And this one was originally $4.49, so I thought that was adorable. Then I also got this that I can actually use now for spring, and I wish I would have picked up more. This one was $3.99, and it's just like a little bouquet, and I think it is adorable so perfect i'm probably gonna most likely keep this and use it for spring but i just love this little bouquet and like i said i wish i would have gotten more darn <laughs> and then i got this jar if you watched my valentine's day haul video you saw that i actually picked one of these up i did end up returning it and i was so happy when i went back and they had them for 6.99 so this was or i'm sorry 66 percent off uh this was 12.99 and then i got the discount but i love it the top does come off so I definitely think I'm going to use it somewhere next year. I really, I really love it. Lastly, from Hobby Lobby Valentine's Clearance, I got these Valentines. I have a little girl, so these will be perfect for her to hand out next year. So, and they're like the scratch color things. My daughter loves these, so perfect. All right, now we're gonna move on to the Hobby Lobby Spring and Easter. That does include uh, some St. Patrick's Day stuff. I am not decorating my house for St. Patrick's Day, but I am gonna do a St. Patrick's Day coffee bar, so you're gonna wanna stay tuned for that. So I'm gonna show you just a few items that I picked up. So first, I got this Shamrock cutting board. Now, all of their spring stuff is 40% off. That includes St. Patrick's Day. So I got, it was $4.99, but then I got 40% off. So I thought this was cute. You know me and my obsession with cutting boards. And if you don't know that, you're going to see that in this video. So I just thought that this was really fun. If it feels like I'm going fast, it's because I am, because I have to go pick up my daughter from school soon. <laughs> I got this really cute cutting board. This one was $4.99, and then I got 40% off. 
but I loved it. It says Cottontail Candy Shop. Oh, just, I love it. It's so cute. Next, I got some really pretty florals. Their florals were on sale for 50% off, so I actually got this for $5. I am obsessed with the frosted florals, which you're going to see here more in a minute, but look how pretty these are. I am loving these for spring, and it has that little touch of blush. I'm going to show you the colors I'm going to go with this spring. Oh, just gorgeous. I am, oh, I want to go get another one. I'm just loving this. All right, now these are my two favorite items from Hobby Lobby, and I was not going to, and then I could not, kept, I kept going back to them. Look at this bunny. Look how cute she is. But hold on, hold on. You think she's cute? Ah! Look how cute they are. Look at his little collar. I just love these. These were $17.99, I know, but then you get 40% off, so. I love these. Oh, they're just adorable. Look at them. Even my husband, he like rolled his eyes and he's like, all right, yeah, you're right. They're cute. But look, they have their little baskets. I had to have these. These were adorable. And then I just picked up a little watering can and this is perfect for a tiered tray. So, uh, and you can just fill it with whatever. So yeah, super cute. All right. So that was Hobby Lobby. Now we're gonna move on to the Target dollar spot. And like I said earlier, they are killing it with the spring and Easter. So first I'm gonna start off with St. Patrick's Day because like I said, I am gonna do a St. Patrick's Day coffee bar that's gonna be coming up soon. So first I actually got this leprechaun trap. My daughter and I, we make a leprechaun trap every year. Watch out for the video in, in the coffee bar video. I'm gonna give you some fun St. Patrick's Day ideas that you can incorporate into St. Patrick's Day to make it fun for your littles. But this is just a cute little leprechaun trap and it comes equipped with stickers, uh, gold coins, a, and a dowel rod to like post it up to trap him. So plus she can take markers to it. She can decorate it. She can do whatever she wants. But I just thought this was perfect. This was $3. So I thought, you know, it comes with everything you need. So it's perfect. All right, next, I am really getting into getting these Malamine plates. I think that these are adorable for your kiddos, uh, for breakfast, for lunches, uh, for when you go to serve. I got some uh, Halloween ones. I got some Valentine's Day ones. Uh, I'm sure I'll get some Easter eggs or rabbits or something. So I just thought that these were so, so pretty. So of course I got two because I have uh, two daughters. So uh, yeah, so I just thought that these were super cute for that reason. All right, next up, I got this little uh, coffee, it's like a coffee mug, but I, I'm just gonna put something in it, and it says liquid gold, which I thought was cute for a coffee bar. This one was $3, so, um, and actually, it's been a while since I've seen my St. Patrick's Day stuff too, so I'm gonna have to go through my bins, but I just thought that this would be a fun little addition to a tiered tray, and to go along with that, I also got these little jars i have seen these for every season never picked any up yeah you could make it but it would cost you more than three bucks um, by the time you bought the jars and everything to go in them so this one has like little shamrock confettis and this one says lucky shamrocks and then this one says pot of gold so it has little gold coins and then this one says Lep leprechaun dust and it's just um, oh, that is so cute. It's just uh, like little um, green confettis. So these are adorable for a tiered tray. So I'm going to go ahead and definitely add those on. I also got this right here. This is another great piece for tiered tray. Actually is for, it's called a prop pack, but it actually is for tiered tray uh, decor. And this one says luck. This one says sh shamrocks and shenanigans, which is why I got it. And then the cute little leprechaun or gnome, whatever you want to, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> So I love that too. They had a couple of these different ones. Uh, so you can pick up the ones that you love, but they have the cutest day, the stuff for St. Patrick's Day. I also picked up some chocolate gold coins for my daughter um, for the day of. And like I said, I'm going to go through a video where I show you what exactly we do for St. Patrick's Day just to add some magic. All right, now going into the Easter and spring decor from Target Dollar Spot. They killed it, you guys. I, I just love it. I love the colors they're going with. So first we're going to start off with these. I got these bird cages. They were $5. I got two of them because I think birds is going to be the theme of my mantle. I have some bird cages, so I think these are going to go right. They're going to be perfect right in it. 
So I did get two. Now you can actually hang a string or something and actually hang these. So if you wanted to, you would have to glue the bottom down, but I just think they're gorgeous. I think they're gorgeous. They would actually also make really cute centerpieces if you put some moss inside with some eggs or a bird or something like that. So loving these. I just love birds for spring. I think that's so pretty. Then I got this really cute. It's a, They're calling it a serving platter. It was $5. They did have a couple different ones. Um, one had like blue on it. I'm not going for the blue, but I love this for spring and Easter, of course. And it has the carrots and I absolutely love it. Again, you can have, you can um, add a string and you can hang it too. So I can't wait. This is going to be a great layering piece in my kitchen. So it's really nice. Ceramic. Love it. All right, now here we go with my cutting board addictions. They have the cutest cutting boards. So I picked up this egg. It was $5, super cute. But then they have the bunny. Look how cute. Look how cute. $5. Now, if you watch uh, the Daily DIYer, which I'm sure you do, she actually took one of these bunnies. She drilled a hole in the bottom, put a dowel rod, put it on a post, and used it as decor. I think I'm going to do that. But not with these. I saw something from the Dollar Tree that I'm going to use that she also suggested. So I'm definitely gonna do that. So thanks to the Daily DIYer for that idea. But so many different ideas you can do with these. Just use them as decor, perfect layering pieces. Loving it. And for this spring and Easter, I'm going with the natural woods. I'm going with the blush pinks, the blush yellows, basically pastels. So yeah, so that's those are the colors I'm going with. So it's gonna be gorgeous. And another thing to go along, this is a tear tray. This is a freaking tear tray. Ah, okay, so excited about this one. Here's what it looks like. Five dollars, five dollars. That is nothing for this tear tray. Ah, I need scissors, I don't feel like getting up, but I love it. And here's how it opens, okay? So it's two tears and it has the bunny ears. Oh, I just love it, I cannot wait. Oh, it's been years since I decorated for Easter, so I cannot wait. It's one of my favorite holidays. Love it. But it is that natural wood, kind of, it's like a light natural wood. I wouldn't say white, but people did paint them white. If you want to do that, you can. But I thought this was gorgeous. And $5? Are you kidding me? Shoot. All right, next up, we got these cute little rain boots. These were $3. I got two. I'm not sure if I'm going to use both. They did have these in other colors, but these would be a cute flower arrangement. Oh yeah, I'm gonna use them. Cause look how cute they are next to each other. Oh, they're adorable. You just stick some flowers in it and call it a day. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Yeah, so they did have other colors, but like I said, I'm kind of going with the blush pinks. This is a little bit more corally, I guess, but I still think it is so pretty. So definitely loving these rain boots. So cute. All right, next up, I thought that these were so cute for decor. They have these little animals, and these were $3, but I just thought that these would be cute additions into tier trays. They had a bunch of different animals, but of course, I picked up the little bunny and the little chick. I thought they were so cute, and they just stand up. So these would be really cute gifts as well. You can put a name on it and give it away to a little, um, a, a little somebody in your life. That was corny. Please don't unsubscribe. Okay, anyway, so these are adorable, and I wish I would have gotten more of these. I might pick more of these up because I could just see them all over my house. They're so cute. Plus, they have that pink, which I'm going with too. This, I could not believe they had. Look how cute. Look at that bunny. How adorable is that? And then it does come with like this little plastic riser, so you could, you could decorate that up. You could put treats. I'm pretty sure it's food safe. Let me see food safe there you go so you can put some little treats in it i think this is adorable it was only five so how stinking cute is that oh i i am just loving that i hope you can see how cute the bunny is yeah oh adorbs all right, next up, I got these bunnies, and these bunnies hang off of things. Now, I'm not really into plants. I mean, I, I, I'm into faux plants, because I, yeah, I don't want to have to take care of anything more than my kids and my dog, uh, or keep them alive, I should say. But I just thought that these would be fun hanging off of decor pieces, like mugs, or canisters or my utensil holder. I mean, if you want to just add like little touches of Easter, 
pick this up it was five dollars and you can hang these off of anything so look how cute it is just so adorable and i can't wait to just display these little guys everywhere i think they're so fun all right next up this is just a all year round decor piece and i know that these were really popular something that you'd see on pottery barn west elm crate and barrel places like that it's just your basic it says bookshelf decor so i'm definitely going to use these i love these it was three dollars it's that wood that i really love you could also get it you can paint them black you can paint them white you can do a stain on them whatever you want to do but I think that these are going to be really cute just a great embellishment to the decor you already have so great love this piece another great item is this basket I love this color it's like that mint color if you followed me for my winter decorate with me you know that I went with like that mint theme loving it still so this and like the pink is going to be my color this year or my colors this year and the pastels so I just love this. We can use it to put towels in, maybe in the bathroom and put toilet paper in, something like that. $5 for this basket, but I absolutely love it. You can, of course, always use it as an Easter bunny, as an Easter basket and give it away to somebody, but so many different ideas for this. Can't wait to use it. And it has the chicken wire. I am just obsessed. I love it. All right, next up, I got these two little topiaries. Now, if you followed me for my Valentine decorate with me, you know that I actually used two topiaries and glued hearts on them. Well, these came with the eggs on them. So I thought this was perfect. I picked up two because I'm basically going to do the same thing I did for Valentine's Day. I'm even going to use the same little uh, planters that I did. So you're going to want to... Uh, follow me for that and see how I decorate for spring and Easter but these are just so cute they were five dollars and I'm absolutely obsessed and those colors of the eggs are is definitely what I'm going for so I'm loving that this is another all year round piece as if I don't have enough look at this little riser now I think I might actually whitewash this because it's just a little too boring for me so I might actually add some white to this but I am obsessed with this you guys know I love 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 to your trays and risers I have I have a problem just like with the cutting boards but I saw this for five bucks and I'm like yes I mean even if I were to make this by the time I bought the beads, by the time I, yeah, it, it would be $5 anyway. So I thought, you know what, for five bucks, I am getting it. And again, it's another piece you can use all year round. And then, you know, I'm in a huge organizational thing around my house. So I picked up two of these. They do spin. They are Lazy Susans. Uh, it says rotating storage tray. They're only $5. And look, there's two section so they have the inside section and then this so i mean anywhere kitchen craft room bathroom anywhere at all i got two of these because i thought oh my gosh these are perfect for me to start organizing my stuff so you're going to be seeing these used it somewhere in my house in one of my upcoming organization videos so definitely stay tuned for that but for five bucks i thought these were perfect all right, another piece that I got from Target Dollar Spot. Look how cute this little thing is. I just see this as a flower market or a farmer's market. And again, it has that mint color, which I'm really going for this spring. So I thought that this was so cute. So many different ideas with this. And I think I have a few in mind that I'm going to do. Uh, but I think that this is adorable. Next up, I got this watering can. I think that this is so cute. Again, it's that blush pink. I absolutely love it. And I think this is going to fit perfectly into my decor. So I can't wait to incorporate this. And then I got this really cute mushroom. I just love this. Mushrooms kind of have a special meaning in my family. My grandma's family actually owned a mushroom farm. So um, I don't know, anytime I see mushrooms, I think of my grandma. So I definitely wanted to pick one up. They had other ones too. They had a white one. I think I might go back and get the white one as well. But I just thought that this was adorable just to incorporate somewhere in my decor. All right, so that was all of Target Dollar Spot. Now let's move on to Dollar Tree. So before we do Dollar Tree I do want to shout out Dollar General I was there and they had their little picks for a dollar so I picked some up which is cheaper than Dollar Tree but anyway so look at these little picks I love them and as you know like I said I'm obsessed with the like the frosted type of florals this year so I just picked up a bunch of their picks and like I said they were a dollar each so I think these are going to be so pretty in some arrangements. I'm really trying to add some more greenery around here. 
So that was Dollar General. All right, now moving on to the Dollar Tree, sticking along with the same theme. Every time I see these, I get them because I just think they're so pretty. Um, these are, it just says greenery. And these are the frosted, and I have a ton still at my mom's, so I'm gonna have to get those. But like I said, I really just want these colors everywhere in my house, so I wanted to pick up a bunch, and I just thought that these would be perfect. So yeah, so I got all these picks, so cute. Next up. I saw these and I was like, oh my gosh, they're already done. They are beads. Now I didn't get a lot from the Dollar Tree. I got more decor pieces, cause as you know, I'm trying to sell off a lot of my decor or my craft items. So right now I'm just getting decor pieces and I thought that this was adorable. These, when I say the colors I want, these are it. It's like that um, turquoisey or teal. It's the pale blue. It's the pink. And then it has a cute little bunny at the bottom with a tassel. So I thought that this was adorable. Then they had this one, which is a carrot. And then it also has a carrot at the bottom and green twine. So I thought this was so cute. And then they also have this one, which I thought was adorable as well. And it has a little chick at the bottom. So I could totally see me using these in numerous different places in my home. I think they are so pretty. Then to kind of go with St. Patrick's Day, I did pick this up. And I think I'm gonna remove this and just add a shamrock, but how perfect for St. Patrick's Day. I think it is so cute. I don't think I have wooden beads for St. Patrick's Day, but you all know that these are perfect for tier trays. So I'm definitely going to be using this. Next up, I picked up these eggs. Again, I'm thinking decor pieces. I think they're so, so pretty. It just says decor, but I love these. I made something like these on my channel in 2021, and they did not even come out as cute as these. So I'm like, for $1.25, you get three of them. I, I might go even pick more up, I'm not sure. But I think I know the perfect little place. I'm gonna put these. They come in two different packs. So you have the blue, yellow, and pink, and then you have the cream, purple, and green. So I thought that these were so cute. Cute. Perfect for decorating. Then I got these cute little eggs. One has A for Amelia, one has C for Charlotte, and I thought that these were adorable. I absolutely love them. I might actually paint this one pink because it will go with my decor more, but either way, I just think that these are adorable. And then I found these cute little spatulas. They did have two different kinds. They had these, which was the more pale uh, colors, and then they had like more bold or like hot pink, but I wanted the pail and this one says egg hunt and then this is just a little bunny look how cute I'm trying to get it to focus there we go okay so there we go so look how cute that is so adorable and they're just like little spatulas they were in they were not in the kitchen section they were in like the Easter stuff and then lastly from the Dollar Tree, I saw these and I thought they were so cute. I got these little girls. They do have a boy, but I got two girls because my daughters and I thought they were adorable. Look how cute these are. And what I'm planning on doing is actually using it as standing decor. So I'm actually gonna put, um, I don't know, I'm gonna make them stand somehow. And then I think I might put them on my fireplace. I don't know, but I think they are adorable and just ah oh, they're just so cute now you can get the boy and the girl i might go get the boy i don't know i i can't decide i can't decide but i just think they're so cute and just ah oh, they're just adorable and i'm loving the colors too all right, now this last item did not come from anywhere we talked about. This actually came from Home Goods, and I had to get it. And when you see it, you'll know why. Look how cute. It says my first Easter, and it has the little stockings. But look, it has bunny ears. How adorable is that? So yes, Charlotte's first Easter is coming up, so I thought this would be cute for taking photos, and uh, it's just so adorable. And these make really cute gifts too. I am a sucker for anything like this. Any cute outfits, I do, I do it, I go all out, so as you could probably imagine. So I think those are really cute ideas as well. All right, is that everything? I think so. I picked up some stuff for Charlotte's Nursery. I'm gonna be sharing that in a different video. I picked up some stuff to make St. Patrick's Day, a lot more fun gonna be sharing that in a different video so please don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already also give this video a thumbs up if you loved what you saw today I want to thank you so much for joining me today I hope you got a lot of great ideas on some decor pieces that you can pick up and until I see you again I'll haul with you soon bye